Met you? Sorry, I'm explaining to him what's happened. Okay. Um, yeah, so uh, I guess... Robert McGill, are you doing anything in the meantime? So Robert is just going to sort of walk out into the, the middle ground here. I'm not like trying to draw their attention over this way, but I think Robert will stop here, face uh, face in this direction, so that uh, you know the back half of his loincloth is exposed. Buttocks is facing the the dragons, and he's just going to start scratching his ass and groaning. Oh my god. You're just like, eh. All right. Um, are you doing, like, are you trying to get their attention? Uh, I'm not, like, yeah, yeah, I guess I am, yeah, yeah. All right. In that case, you see that, um, make a, uh, make a performance check. <laughs> They both kind of like raise their heads and kind of like uh, look at you as you're uh, scratching your ass, and they kind of just like both tilt their heads. <laughs> like the green dragon turn tilts his a little bit like to the left, and then the re- white one turns it to the uh, the right. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> okay, that's that's exactly what I wanted. I want them to like just. Not, not look to the tents, basically. All right, Jib Jib, uh, please roll me a stealth check when you get an advantage, or at advantage when you get a moment, please. Okay, it's coming. There we go. Hello. 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 All right, so 14, yeah, you managed to slink, slink by as um, uh, the dragons both fix are fixated on Robert McGill. Now, okay. grab a torch. <laughs> Me? <laughs> yeah, you and Caddy are going to run along the back of them, lighting them all on fire at the rim. <laughs> You notice that there's a torch on this pillar there, uh, Jib Jib. Am I visible at, from Mio Mio, or can she see me? Like, what what's happening? I don't really know what's happening. Uh, yeah. So, um, I just had Jib Jib uh, kind of sneak up to this. Um, so I don't know how much Lauren filled you in, but you and Robert McGill have been uh, tying their tents shut like the tent doors and uh i guess your plan is to set the tents on fire so i'm I'm just letting you know that you have a uh a torch above you on on the pillar here okay i'll that is take the torch all right Mio Mio's in a yoga pose and like does a fire cloth salute to jib jib if you can see as he reaches up to uh, get uh, it that's Robert's- what i'm doing <laughs> Robert stops scratching his ass and he just starts walking back, but he, he's just going to quickly wave uh, towards Jib Jib to like wave him kind of oh, quietly back, back to us. The fire menacingly glows in Jib Jib's eyes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, as soon as as soon as like Jib Jib gets back to, I don't know. I don't want to interrupt Mio Mio, so maybe, maybe like here. He's pretty okay. enthralled. Robert's gonna gonna wait for Jib Jib to get back to him. Um, I'm All guessing right. that moving around with a torch is a bad idea. So maybe I'll go around the pillars like this. You gotta light it on fire though. Oh, I thought this fire thing was the torch. Oh, if it's not lit, then uh, yeah, I'll just walk well, back. We were going to uh, light well, a fire. No, the yeah, the grab torch the here, you mean? Light. Grab the torch, then light yeah, that's it on a fire. Little. Then light it on fire, run around. Light it on fire. Run around. Dodge the poop. Light it on fire. And come to us. 
I still oh you like same for cat. I'm taking the fire that's right here. Correct. And I'm lighting all of the fire all of the tents on fire. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Somehow I've convinced everybody this is a great idea. Yeah, I'm, I'm super, super psyched. <laughs> um so as soon as I light one of these things on fire, I don't have to be stealth anymore, right? Uh, 50-50. The dragons, we haven't thought of a plan to deal with. So I would advise maybe not running in straight out. <laughs> Unless you just want to... <laughs> actually, actually, with that, uh, Glue is actually going to turn to you, Caddy Wampus, as it finally like stops looking at uh, Robert McGill and notices you right there. See, it starts to like lumber up, like to its feet. Tight and go, tight and go, go tight and go. Sleep, go to sleep. <laughs> the fuck. Well, I, uh, up, up and I grab the torch and I just, I, I, I go. <laughs> okay. Leroy uh, Jenkins. <laughs> these two immediately get to their feet. Uh, I'm going to say roll initiative, everybody. I'm gonna stab this guy in the throat. Totally black widow, that guy. Yeah. <laughs> Are the tents already tied shut? Yes. Yep. Oh my you guys God. have tied the uh, tents shut. Oh, I deleted Jib Jib. I'm sorry. Oh my god. god. I was getting rid of my marker. <laughs> One second. I'll oh, get him. I can put him there. Oh, there you go. Never mind. You don't need me. <laughs> oh, we need you. <laughs> don't go anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> Look at all this tomfoolery. <laughs> All right. One sec. Trying to roll here. There, there we go. Woo! Twenty-five. God damn! Light them on fire! You can just like fly uh, above all of them in a straight line, just like lighting them from above. All right, Caddy Wampus, what are you doing? Uh, I am going to, uh, well, I flew up to the torch. I'm gonna grab it and let's just see. I wanna just like hold it out and light it, light these as I fly by. I just wanna calculate the distance here. I have 45, so. Yeah, I can like get to about oh here. Okay. So I'd be able to light at least those two, I think. Okay. Uh, so as you fly by, yeah, I'll say that it's uh, an action to light both of those on fire. And then, yeah, that's that's all I do. All right. All right, if that's everything you'd like to do, uh, Mio Mio, you are up. As you uh, see this guy kind of turn his head, he's like, what? I accidentally deleted Jib Jib's initiative. He was 12. I don't know if you're uh, I to... just added him again. Beautiful. There we go. Uh, Mio Mio is going to have started doing like a sword dagger dance kind of thing, like drawing them in like from flowing yoga into like, look what else I can do. Um, so then I'm going to stab him through the chest with my flower blade. <laughs> Oof. All right. And say, like don't look away from me. <laughs> oh, I didn't know. That. That's okay. <laughs> Uh, and 
and then I'm going to rage and do it again. Gushes. Uh, and then I will wait, but I will give. Okay, Caddy's already gone, so I'll give Jib Jib Bardic Inspiration. It's a D6. Uh, How do you do that? Did you uh, not use your bonus action for rage? Oh, I did. You're right. Sorry. Right. Okay. Next time, though. So my Storm Aura is on. Ooh. Storm Aura. Right, Jib Jib. Jib. Yeah. Stora. Yeah, could her fire claw salute from before combat been bardic inspiration? Oh. No, that's way too far back. Okay. Well, Jim Jim grabs the torch and starts lighting stuff on fire. Alrighty. So that takes an action to light both of them on fire. If it takes my action, I can light it and run to there. All right. You see the green dragon, or hear the green dragon, like just leper to its feet. Yeah, uh, that's all I'm gonna do for now, even though I'm terrified. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Run. Um, let's see if. Okar hears anything. That was a misclick. <laughs> the hell's first album. <laughs> We're a band. <laughs> uh, Okar is actually going to uh, get out of his tent at uh, the hearing the dragons like start to rumble around and he's like, what's that? Get the fuck out of my way, okay. Alright, he's gonna get out of the uh, tent there, and he's like, We're under attack! And he's going to draw his uh, flame blade, he's gonna like charge forward, but uh, that's gonna be his turn. Um, the white scales are going to get up. Uh, jib Jib. Uh, you hear uh, the two of them kind of like ruffling around like at the where they're I guess the the tents are tied and they're like what 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 uh, and they're gonna try and uh, start they're you start to hear them scream like they're gonna try and escape at disadvantage. They are scared as shit. Robert needs to prepare right, so the explosive like gas. <laughs> uh, the second guy just yeets the fuck out of his tent like... <laughs> he gets out and he's like, what the fuck? Uh, but that's going to take his turn uh, as the other two were actually... Oh yeah, no, the other two need to make
this guy is going to pop out of his tent. And this guy is going to be like, ah, fucking stop. Uh, shit. I got to do this again? Sorry, guys. Just gonna... Uh, these two cattywampus are going to, uh, just start shrieking in their tents, and then this guy's gonna pop out. And this guy's still trapped, but, yeah, that's gonna be their turn. Uh, the green dragon wormling is going to, uh, take off. But... Fly right. Zoom overhead uh, there, Jib Jib, as he's making his way to you. Uh, and that is going to be... Wait. Uh, he's going to use his poison breath. A 15-foot cone. So please make a DC 11 constitution saving throw. I think I clicked it. Huh? I'm gonna click it again. Oh, okay. Oh, goddamn, son! <laughs> Off your he's back as if it's nothing. Yeah, he's a bar uh, barbarian for nothing. Yeah. Then it's Blue's turn. I spent a lot of time around Robert, boys, and I'm I'm not the average height of the mold. <laughs> I'm like mid level. <laughs> <laughs> I am face height for farts. <laughs> <laughs> I am immune to that shit. <laughs> Run faster! This one's just gonna land on this guy's tent. And he's gonna uh, try and bite you there. Um, uh, nope, no, no, uh, no, 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 no. caddy. I hope not. Sorry, it's just slow for me. Uh, nope. Nope. Dodge. Dodge. Alright. Your turn. Alright. You know what, Mr. Dagron? Um, yeah. We're gonna try to punch this dragon. Um. Ba 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 ba. Sorry. Punch a dragon? Heresy. 22 for 12 magical bludgeoning, and I'm going to expel a key point. It needs to make a con save or be uh, stunned. Okay. My save yeah. for that is just a second. I fucking forget. I'm pretty sure the save is... Shouldn't be that high. I think it's like 14 or something, but I'm just going to ch double check here. It's spellcasting using your wisdom. Oh, it's spellcasting using my wisdom? I'll just do check that in my spells then. So if I were to use wisdom... 14, yeah. I was right, it's 14. Alright, odds or evens? Oh. Oh. Odds. Woo! This dragon is out fucking boom! So since it's stunned, I'm going to have um advantage on this next attack. Okay. And on the next two after that, because as a bonus action oh, I'm gonna yeah. do flurry of blows. Uh, Don't forget the tents! Dragon. 
All right, that hits. And on the last one, I'll also do a Hands of Harm, so he takes an extra four. Yeah, that last one uh, would kill him, so how do you do this? Oh, so Caddy I gets two I hands just, and blows. I punch right through its skull. Just like, I just kind of go up to it and I go, like a bunch on its head until it literally caves the fuck in. Yep. And that'll be my turn. Okar shouts at you, you monster! Oh I'm, I'm Joseph! <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> That's my All response. Right. <laughs> Is that everything you'd like to do? Yeah, I, 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 I won't lie. I kind of feel badass. <laughs> All right. I owe a baby dragon, yeah. Or mid level. I... Oh shit! I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> anyway. There. As they start to make their way in. Uh, Mio Mio, you're up. Hmm. Lauren? Uh, yeah, sorry, I was oh, thinking. Sorry. No, no, uh, I'm sorry. Mio Mio will step up. Um, and I'll let my rage drop in order to cast Shatter on the Ooh. dragon and the kobold behind Jib Jib. Oh, no rage. <laughs> Ooh, goddamn. All right, so that kobold's going to make a... The dragon's also going to make a con save first, so... Uh, so my yeah, my rage anyway. drops away, and I go jib jib run, and I like throw out my hands, and it goes kaboom behind him, like a thunder oh, clap. <laughs> my thighs clap so that... together. <laughs> and that kobold. Jib jib's hand is cool. So Guys, don't I'm... look at explosions. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It oh, he's got to make a deck. A shockwave of uh, stuff's happening behind him. And he's just like, la, 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 la. <laughs> yeah, that awesome fucking <laughs> straight up kills him. He just gets sent flying. Nice. And then, um, sorry, on Shatter, does that, it, does a success, uh, is it half the damage or is it? Oh, there we go. Thank you. Half of the okay, so damage. Yeah. All right. So that is. Imagine if a couple mm -hmm. just shatters. It kind of shatters. scatters into the a little bit. All right. Uh, is that everything you'd like to do? Oh, ooh, now as a bonus action, I would like to give Jib Jib Bardic Inspiration. All right. Jib Jib knows to run when he hears it. Yeah, in the run, it was Bardic Inspiration as well as another spell. All righty. So, Jib Jib, you are inspired to uh, fucking run. Definitely. Jib Jib, I'm unseeing Mio Mio starting doing crazy shit. And yelling run, switches the torch to his mouth and switches to all fours and starts running <laughs> faster. He's going to continue nice. with his task to light the torches on fire. The tents, yeah. Yeah, the t yeah, sorry, yeah, the tents. I can't make it to the next one. All right. Uh, this one is going to get an opportunity attack if you run by. Uh, that's okay. Oh, you should attack him right. as you run by. Isn't that 40 just your movement? No, it takes my action to light the tent. I'm still lighting it. It doesn't matter. Uh, I'm still lighting it. Mio Mio yeah, looks mad. 
Uh, so as he runs by, he's gonna get you, nick you with his scimitar there, uh, Jib Jib. Uh, There's like nothing. I'd like to use my reaction since I'm not raging. Okay. To use shield. Yes. Nice. It's not enough. Oh, oh. I'm a I'm a Lord Drake. I have uh, oh, that's right, two eh? cantrips and one spell. Mm -hmm. Fuck, eh? Nice. Okay. Nice. It doesn't that's work, though. It's not enough. It's, it's a little it was thing. cool. Whatever. It was cool. It was cool. It was um, cool. But yeah, this one is... It's like, my tent! You dick! <laughs> Alright. Uh, Okar is going to pull his uh, light crossbow off his back. And he's going to um, come up this way. Uh, he's going to take aim at... Uh, hmm. I'm going to take aim at uh, Mio Mio. Oh god, I thought we had something special as he aims at me. <laughs> that hits. He just snarls at, at you. <laughs> I just wrench it out of my shoulder like it's nothing. <laughs> Oh no, you had to do that, didn't you? You've no. overstayed your welcome. Time to go. Uh, that's going to be his turn. Uh, this kobold is going to uh, run up and attack you, Robert McGill. All right. Ah, oh, five. Okay. Hell. All right, and this one is going to. Oh yeah, this guy's still got to get out of his tent. Yeah, by the fuck. It stinks. <laughs> <gasps> oh thank god and he's going to uh, come out but that's going to be his action uh, this white scale kobold's going to look up at you Caddy Wampus and he's going to pull out his crossbow he's going to try and fire at you how dare he so that 13 I believe misses yes it does all right, uh, this white scale one is going to fire at you as well. Come on now. That misses as well. All right, that misses. God damn it. All right. Uh, Green Dragon Wormling is going to fly up. Uh, and it's going to land, and it's going to try and uh, bite at you, Jib Jib. Ah! For six, ten damage overall. Glue is. Uh, uh, you still have shield on. It's until the end of your next turn. Here we works then. I think it's only one attack, isn't it? Until the yeah, start no. Of your next shield turn. is a reaction. Yeah, but until the start of your next turn, you have a plus five bonus to AC. Plus five to. Oh yes, you do. Against the trigger. Oh, okay. Yeah. Unscathed huh? by his teeth. <laughs> I'm spamming God like an damn. old perspective, or like a. Protective sphere, and he's like, Gum. I'm like, ah! <laughs> I do puppy eye dogs at Mio Mio. <laughs> I was going to deal with Okar. <laughs> All right. I I can't can't get <laughs> uh, Adam? Yeah? Yeah, I, I don't think I'm in initiative order. You're not? Oh, no. Uh, no, I don't think so. 
Oh, oh it's been shit, like eh? Two rounds, yeah, brutal. Yeah. Oh fuck, Robert! I am so sorry. God damn! Wait, I thought you were Robert. All right, Robert. You I mean, I rolled a four, here. so I figured I wasn't gonna be first, but then I just saw, it, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um. All right, Robert. You get two. Uh, you get to do two. St uh, two turns. Um. Uh oh. My bad. I already rolled my attacks. Um. I will. Uh. Yeah. No. We're not. Uh, we'll just go to uh, Robert McGill there. Yeah. That's cool. Um. I don't know. The most helpful thing right now. We can run. It's okay. I guess. Yeah, yeah. I guess uh, Robert is gonna just fog cloud right where he is. It's like shit. <laughs> just, just create. All right, the... fog cloud. All right, I gotta create a twenty foot radius around you. Boom. Okay. All right. And then, uh, I mean, I got to get out of combat, so I'll just book it this way. All right. Or I'll, like, see Mio Mio or something beforehand and rush to get behind her. <laughs> Help me, mommy! <laughs> <laughs> Those white scales are going to uh, swing at you, but it's going to be a disadvantage, even though the, like, I know the area is heavily obscured, but they still, you still left their range, so. Yeah, But yeah. it is a disadvantage. Yeah. Like, ah, oh, what? <laughs> yeah, I don't think that hits anyway, so. Okay, yeah, no. Just a poof and run, yeah, just. <laughs> ah, what? <laughs> Ninja! Cloud! <laughs> uh, yeah, right. so I'm, I'm gonna be, like, hiding behind me. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Robert, I think it's time to leave. Help me, mommy! <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Uh, Caddy, if that is every or everything, Robert, Caddy, you're up. Uh, well, I would have ran up and done those two last the tax I did, but I can re-roll them. All right. Please re-roll. Uh, 27 for 9 and 18 for 11, so 20 total on this guy. Is he still alive? Oh, yeah, I know. He's, he's lo the, the first hit. Actually, no, yeah, no, that killed him. All right. Then I would run up and do flurry of blows on this guy. The second guy just watching after you did his friend, he's like, down, down, down! Uh, 15 for 7 and 17 for 11. I would just, like, run up and, like, punch this guy twice and he'd fall over dead. And if this guy dies too, I'd just run up and snap his neck. Uh, is that everything you'd like and to do? That would be my turn. Yeah, that's my turn. Alrighty. Uh, these white scales are going to try and... Oh, no, wait. It's these white scales. They're going to double their movement speed to get up to here. They're like, oh my god. These two are going to, uh, oh no, wait, they're obstructed. Never mind. There's been a terrible Never. accident. All right, Mio Mio, you're up. As you see, like, this. <laughs> actually, you don't see shit. That's true. That's fine. I am focused. Jib Jib requested my assistance, and I will once again be like... <laughs> Oh no, Jim Jim, get out of there! And I'll cast Shatter over this place so that it hits both the dragon and a kobold again. <laughs> no, not suggestion. Oops. <laughs> All right. It's gonna make a con save. A green dragon. He's getting really annoyed with that shatter. You see, he's just like... 
<laughs> Just come at me, bitch. Don't provoke them. That white scale cobalt just gets fucked. <laughs> and he. Target must make a wisdom. No, wait, that's shit. Never mind. Um... All right. He looks badly fucked up. Okay, well, never mind. They all look. <laughs> oh, I hate that nice. so much. Anyway, is that what you'd like to do with your turn? Uh, and then. As a bonus action, I would like to rage and okay. use my storm aura to hit this guy with a lightning. Okay. He's going to make a con save, correct? Uh, it might be dex. Oh, dex? Oh, yeah, sorry. Yes, it did yeah. say dex. Fuck, I can't read. All right. Get out of the way and <laughs> shock <him. laughs> yeah, See, he only takes three. No. <laughs> Ow! Fuck you! <laughs> oh, you'd love it, wouldn't you? And that's all I do. I, he's like, kind of blushing. Anyway, Jib Jib, you're up. Um, I'm going to continue on my rampage. <laughs> I have my burning. Um, I can't see very good, so I'm going to, like, crash into this tent and try to light it on fire. <laughs> Scrambly, like... <laughs> like a cat in blankets. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nice. Uh, that green dragon is going to try and take a bite at you as you leave its range. Yeah. But it's going to be a disadvantage because you guys are in the... Thing. Chomp, chomp. He misses. Yep. So you make it by, crash into the tent. Um, I just have to double check if I have to pick my my rage shape per rage or long rest each time I rage. Okay, perfect. So. This dragon tries to bite me a few times. I finished my task, and now it's go time. I'm going to rage. And even though no All one right. can see me, they hear my mouth grow. <laughs> <laughs> my teeth just get bigger. My snout gets longer. Get oh, like what? Hair under my chin. And uh, Jib Jib goes into his bestial rage. Oh, shit. Quack a oh, please tell uh -huh. me you have, like, a... I don't have a token for you on this. I'm sorry. No, it's okay. Usually I do his claws, but now I'm, I'm going teeth. All right. Um, and that All is right, what so you're going to bite this one? No, I can't bite him because uh, I use my okay. action to oh, yeah, burn the tent. All right. Does his face look like a dragon? You can't see me. Um, probably not. No, more just like, like a rodent gone wild. <laughs> Like, there's teeth. More crocodile-y. Kara's going to take his crossbow and he's going to shoot at you, uh, Caddy Wampus. Oh, no. Is it at 11? Uh, yeah. That's, uh, that's an 11. Yeah, that's a mess. All right. Uh, these guys are dead. Uh, these guys, this one is going to, uh, try and leave the fog, potentially provoking opportunity attack as he gets out here. Uh, but actually, no. He, oh no, he's good. Uh, he's going to turn back and he's going to see Jib Jib. With the big jaws. He's like, oh my god! Starts swinging wildly, but frantically. Uh, Jib Jib, you get a reaction. Actually, no, you get a free uh, opportunity attack, is what I meant to say. Um, and then I bite him. Do it. Or at least I try to. We'll see. 
Oh, yeah. Oh, that's with outrage oh, yeah, damage. Boy. It does two more. How do you do this? All right, so he, like, runs out of the stuff, kind of sees me, freaks out, swings this thing at me, and I just bite him in his leg and, sh like, death shake him. <laughs> <laughs> like his, his body goes somewhere, and then I throw his leg the other direction. <laughs> just the leg uh, lands right. near Robert. <laughs> quack, quack, quack on the ground. God. <laughs> yeah. He's just mangled. Uh, wow. This guy is going to uh, come around the side, and he's going to take the aim at you, C Caddy Wampus. I refuse. Um, Twenty-four. That Adam. will hit, but I'm gonna try to catch it. All right. Um. So let's just see here. Ba -ba 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 Deflect missiles. So I got it to roll a d10 plus your dex plus your. So that's 1d10 plus 7 plus. I'm gonna. St like, I'm pretty sure I catch it regardless. Because let's just um, see. Because it's like 1d10 plus 10 or something ridiculous like that. Uh, bah, 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 bah. It says if you catch a missile. So it would be f your dex. So yeah, no, it's 7 plus 12. Okay, plus 5. So that's. So if I reduce it to 0 or less, I catch it and I can spend another. Um... Like I can basically so throw it right back at him. Um. Uh... Did you have to roll higher than the attack? Higher uh, than the damage. No, it's higher, higher than, than the, the damage. damage. Then, yeah, you, guys are... you just catch it. So I'm going to catch it, and I will expel one more key point, and I'm going to throw it back. So basically, I'm just going to... Launch it at this it. attack with proficiency. Yeah. All right. It, so make just a, what uh, damage does it do? Does it do the same damage? Monk weapon. It's just, it's just yeah. monk weapon. It's just oh, it's a monk weapon. Oh, okay. Well, then I just roll a normal unarmed attack, and it would be the same thing. So it would be like sixteen for six, except it would do like piercing instead of bludgeoning. Flies into his throat. Kills How him. you like them apples? <laughs> Uh, seeing this now uh, smaller creature with a larger, larger mouth, this green dragon is going to roar at you there, Jib Jib. And that's going to uh, go towards you, like charge at you, and it's going to try and bite you. Am I still obscured? I was obscured uh, last yes time. You are. <laughs> yes, you were. <laughs> Whew, whew. But it misses. Uh, Robert McGill, you were up. Okay. Robert's gonna move up just past Mia Mio. So that face. that was focused on a point, right? The uh, fog, like that little spot right in front of Mio Mio? Yeah. The little X I did? Okay, yeah. so I, I have it with you, but I'm going to have to try and find a way to... No. Yeah, use the dead. Anyway, the move it to... Yeah, yeah, there we go. Sorry, I'm taking up time with that. But anyway, what would you like to do? Okay, uh, so I'm moving around Mio Mio, and then I'm going to... Uh... Okay, sorry, I had your charisma modifier. So I'm going to cast a uh, poison spray at the dragon. Uh, I'm gonna say that because like you're still obscured, that's like I'm gonna have you to ask you to roll a perception check at disadvantage at least. Okay. Make sure you're even aware that the dragon's there. 
just hoses Jim Jim. No! <laughs> yeah. Don't do it, I can't shield All right, anymore. You do hear this, this, even in the pitch of uh, the fog, you can see, like, a general moving of the dragon, like, green dragon's wings, like, just go over your head there, uh, Robert McGill. Nice. But yeah, you're able to uh, spray it that way. So I add my charisma modifier to the damage because it's poison, so it's All right, it's gonna make three a extra. Monster. Three extra? Oh, yeah. it fails. Uh, it's actually not going to take that poison damage at all. Oh. As it just, like, absorbs into its scales. Okay. Oh, I forgot. I'm uh, also a bard. So can I give, um, can I give Jib Jib Bardic Inspiration? You absolutely can. I haven't okay. used it yet. You can't stack it. Oh. Oh, okay. You, you, okay. You can right. give me a Mio inspiration, or a Caddy uh, one. I'll, I'll give uh, I'll give Caddy some inspiration. I'll just point at him and go, Ooh. "You got it, buddy." All right. Finger guns. Is that everything you'd like to do? Yeah. Yeah. All right, uh, Caddy, you are up. Um, all right. Well, I am going to go up to this dude. And I am going to attempt to beat the crap out of him. Uh, Alright. 15. He blocks your blow with his flame blade. <laughs> Alright. I'm going to add my inspiration to that. So that's just a D4 or a D6. You've already added your inspiration. I didn't give you another I one. I meant the bardic one I just got. Oh, the bardic one. Oh, correct. Yeah. Okay, sorry. Sorry, go ahead. Is that a D6 or a D4, Robert? Oh, it's a D4. I think it's a D6. Oh. Uh, no, I think it he has be. D4, I have D6. Oh, you have? Yeah. Okay. So you have know, D4, so my apologies. 17, 17 instead of 15? Uh, odds or evens? Evens. Yeah, boy. Yep. Boom. And I'm gonna make, and I'm gonna make that a stunning strike. So he's gotta make okay. a con save. All right. He's gonna take his damage first, little bitch. All right. So he's gonna make a con save. But oh, he damn, takes damn. it as a chance. It's like, who taught right. you to hit your husband? Wow. Um, I don't even know what to say to that. I kind of want to say, know your mama, but... Yeah, that's what I say. I say, know your mama. I have one last key point, but I should save it. So that will be my turn. All right. Uh, these white scales are going to uh, all start looking into the... Uh, they're going to start just open firing into the crowd, so... Or into the cloud, sorry. They're all shooting at disadvantage, so... Bunch of arrows in there. Hit the dragon, uh, hit the dragon. One of them hits, oh fuck, he would be like kicked right the fuck out. Uh, so one's gonna miss you, Mio Mio, as you hear one going over your head. It pierces the stink. <laughs> <laughs> There's like a little like clean air trail through it. <laughs> Uh, one is going to uh, eat the free air miss again. You again. Uh, Mio Mio. One is going to, uh, or actually, they're going to come up here. 
traps so they can get a range. And one is going to go for Robert McGill. Oh, that should have been a disadvantage. My apologies. All right, so 15. Oh, 15 for 11. All right. At least it's not a crit. It's a light crossbow. It's a light crossbow. That's going to miss. Uh, Mio Mio, you're up. How uh, tall, high is this? 15 feet? Or 10? Uh, yeah, about 15 feet. So if I walk over and straddle the poop... The poop? <laughs> uh, the poop? <laughs> essentially, I want to put my hands against the wall that they're standing on and cast Shatter up through it. to, Or, sorry, Thunder Wave to catch them in a Thunder Wave from, like, beneath. So I'm just okay. essentially wondering if it's within, if they're within range of that. They Thunder they'd be within cube. range, but it's like it's it's a fifty. I guess the sight cube. line, like it's just a matter of shooting it up. But I don't know if that matters. Well, it originates from me. Is it's a yeah. cube? It's fifteen feet high as well. If it's a cube. It is. A cube. Okay, so in... so she puts right, out so a nine place, yeah. square kaboom. That's fifteen feet tall. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Wide. Yeah. No, that's fair. I'm just uh, like sight line and all that, but I guess it doesn't matter. So um, yeah, I, yeah. I guess magic. <laughs> yeah. Sight line. So I they're going my to... hands against the wall, and I go stop it. All right. Then I have good. to make con saves. That one fails, that one fails. Mm. I don't know what that one does. That one fails. They all fail. Boom! <laughs> and they all take nine, nine damage. Boom! And I say, get out of here! The Fireclaw clan has deemed you unworthy. Alright, and they got shot back yeah, Clan has beat you. Alright, they get shot back. And Jib Jib, you're up. Or actually, no, Mio Mio, did you have anything else you'd like to do? I would like to I essentially intimidate them, but I think that's like a full action. But I want to be like, the Fireclaw Clan yeah. takes over this area. Get out of here. I'll have to do a resolve thing, roll for each of them on their next turn. Um, but yeah, we'll go to Jib Jib. Things are not turning in their favor. Jib Jib starts wildly, recklessly, even just biting at anything within range. Get him, Jib Jib. All right. So I want a trim to bite the dragon. I'm going to do it recklessly, right. too, so I cancel out the disadvantage. All right. I'm going to ask you to roll a, um, a, a d4, please. To see- oh, actually, you know what? Robert's not even in range. Uh, go ahead. That fucking hurts. Ha <laughs> ha. Now, is he still heavily obscured if I, like, if I'm right up against him, biting him? If I bite him again? Technically, uh, Matt, technically, since you're uh, attacking recklessly and um, Robert's in, next to you, you would have advantage because you guys are forgetting your pack tactic. Since you're both within five feet of it, you gain advantage anyways. Yeah, I don't think they would stack you like up. Like the roll, though. it's it's Adam's. Oh, call. that's ahead. right. That's right. That's right. I just do it reckless because I want to, because it's. I yeah. mean, the, I'm I'm obscured 
attacking wildly. All right, yep. Yeah. So you uh, sink your teeth into it however you want. I, I don't know, I'd bite its wing. <laughs> I would yeah. like to bite more That's times. Me. Do it. My, my next question was, now that I'm biting it, do I know where it is and I cancel out the disadvantage from the smoke? Or am I still No, it's still... The, the smoke is still active, so it would still be at disadvantage. Okay. I'm still reckless, so it'll cancel out that yeah. way. Yeah. So, yeah. Sinks in. Could you be so reckless? And I want to, like, um, just, I don't know, dig my claws in a little bit, try to get some grip on them, and as a bonus action, I will uh, use an offhand attack. All right. I'll add uh, bardic to that. Oh, yes, you can. 18. 18, yeah, that hits. Dealing four slashing damage, magical slashing damage. This dragon it is letting out, like, just cries of pain that's filling the chamber. Nice, that's all Jib Jib does. Just start tearing into this thing. All right. Um, if that's everything on your turn, Okar is going to... Let's see if he makes a resolve. Uh, with that, he's going to... Uh, Say, if I die, I die for the white scales. And he is going to attack you there, uh, Caddy. The burning scimitar. He's going to go down fighting. 18 for... Hello? Can you hear me there, uh, Evan? Oh, you're, you're muted. Oh, Sorry, 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 sorry. I was muted. I was saying that's odds or evens, but I pick odds. All right, there we go. Odds that misses. Ooh. All right, that's and odd. he is going to try and swing at you again. Dodge, 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 dodge. Dodge. All right, that's going to be his turn, though. Uh, these guys. See if they stay around after that. Uh, they are going to get the fuck out. Very much heeding uh, Mio Mio's uh, warning and being like, yep, we lost this one. Exactly, leave. They fucking left. Uh, this green dragon is going to... They just run screaming. Oh my god! <laughs> uh, this dragon is going to rear its head back and just like, in a last ditch effort, just like breathe uh, poison breath on you. Anybody within this area. So, uh, both Jib Jib and Mio Mio, please make a constitution saving throw. It's not that hard. <laughs> She's 20 feet away. She's 20? Oh, that is. That's oh. right. right. Like, right there. So, just Jib Jib, then. I take it, too. Uh, it's originating from the center of the dragon, so no, you're, like, just out of range. Oh, okay. Take the win. Alright, so that definitely saves. Uh, so it's going to roll for...
Uh, you're going to take 21 poison damage. You rolled a perfect average. That's awesome. <laughs> Sweet. All right. Uh, but that's going to be its turn. Robert McGill. All right. Uh, so this thing seems to resist my poison spray, so I'll shoot Magic missile. Oh, and uh, three times, I guess. Pew, 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 pew. Like a machine gun. Adam? You're muted. Oh my fucking god, I am so sorry. <laughs> I've been talking this whole time. Um, yeah, the dragon lets out like this blood curdling cree like screech as like it like falls down dead. <laughs> oh nice. <laughs> Fuck that work. <laughs> I shoot uh, I shot like acidic shit in its face. <laughs> you put three holes <laughs> through him. It's like there's a <laughs> melting holes. <laughs> nice. Well, I'm going to attack twice and use my last flurry of blows. Hopefully something hits. I think only one of those hit, actually. Yeah, the 18 for 11, everything else yeah. misses. Yeah. And that's my turn. <clears throat> Uh, seeing both of his dragons dead, uh, Okar is going to, uh, Ninja look up smoke at bomb. you and look up. Uh, and he is going to drop his sword. Wise move. Uh, he is going to, I am going to end combat there. Uh, but he's like, I surrender. I take his sword. Yeah. You notice that at, since he dropped it, the, the sword is no longer on fire, but it is like kind of like this cool kind of um, contraption there. Like you can see port, like holes in the uh, the blade. I swish it around and I just go... Because that's how magic weapons work. No prisoners! Uh, but yeah, happens. combat is over. Um, do we want to take like a, a ten minute break or something? Sure. I would yeah, right. go in the bathroom. Yeah. yeah. Yes, please. Let's uh, let's go to, for a bathroom. Jim Jim wants to take ten too, so he can rip the head off of this dragon. <laughs>
Hello. Hello. We all got. We got Lauren. Just me, apparently. I'm here. I'm here. Ooh, Adam. We got men. I saw yes. your status was changed to dating. Yeah. Are you seeing someone? Who? I am. Uh, there's this uh, girl, Haley, I met on Hinge that uh, we've been seeing each other for a little while. And, or not a little while. It's been like a month and like a month and a little bit. But nice. yeah. Well, congratulations. Thank you. She's interested in getting into D and D, so I'm hoping to bring up a character with her next next Saturday. Yeah, yeah. that's exciting. Mm -hmm. She said she wants to be like a like a badass kind of like mm. like a assassin character, but like Ooh. she's like I want to like climb on walls and stuff like that. I'm like, how do you feel oh. about like frog people? Tabaxi's <laughs> can climb. They have a climb speed. They do. Ooh. But she was like interested in like the lizard races. Like she's like the lizard man seems cool, and I was like, wait, wait, wait. And I showed her what grungs look like. She's like, that's fucking adorable. <laughs> grungs are awesome. So we'll see how it goes. That's, that's pretty cool. cool. I'm back. Hello. Hello. I found some toast. Oh, excellent. We should, we should we should raid their toast stores. I agree, actually. If they have food. They don't need it now. <laughs> Okar is just sulking. Okar, we gave you a choice. Oh, I'm not there. I went into the tent. Oh, okay. Robert's just gonna like fart. I don't on know who we car. all have back yet. Uh, I have Matt, I'm Lauren. At, okay, so we got everybody. Um, but yeah, combat is over. Ah, stop it! Come on. Take that, you dummy! Oh, stop it! You deserve it. You deserve it. You are mean. We were gonna cook you a nice breakfast. Now you are cooked. <laughs> if, you're, if you're going to kill me, do it. I can't go oh, back we'll to kill you. After this. We'll kill you. But we're gonna do it slow. <laughs> oh, <you> stop it. <laughs> Slowly and painfully. You've already taken my dragons from me. I've got nothing left. Candy, what do you got? Uh, I'm just, I'm just gonna kick him, punch him a couple more times. <laughs> I don't know if I got a roll for it, but <laughs> all right. Do, do you want me to roll for it? Yeah. How are, how are you punching is, him? Is he on his? <laughs> I just, I just want to like. He's on his like, All right, cool. I just kick him in the face. I think a 12 misses. <laughs> <laughs> that misses. <laughs> hell, God damn it. Why can't I roll above a 17? I'll say that, you're, I'll say that you're an advantage because you're like, he's completely surrendered. Like, he's at your mercy. So okay. you can go. <laughs> and even kick Come a man while he's down. <laughs> 24 for 12, right in the face. <laughs> oh! First one was a joke. He huh? him to the ground, and he falls down. He's like wiping blood off his lip. Mio, Wait, Mio, so I am roughing him up. And I do air quotes. <laughs> I'm not there. <laughs> I'm fluffing him up. Uh, Jim Jim. Okay, no. I think he'd rather be beaten than farted on, man. Come on. <laughs> Jim Jim's just poking the dragon. It's a combination. Just silently, like, poke, poke. Okar, 
Okar, tell us where your food is. Tell us your all. Oh, all sorry. I was... the chili peppers. Oh, it's just back there. We Our rations are just down at the far end. We should Fashion probably get them to tell like us their supply train routes, too, so we can cut off their supply routes and therefore starve them out if need be. It sounds like an excellent strategic decision, uh, but I'd rather ask him where he keeps his finest wines and, and, and goodies. Where are they, Okar? Sadly, we drank all the wine. Actually, not sadly. I. We were about to get uh, another store, uh, another shipment soon, but I that don't you guys lying. Make a uh, make a persuasion check or uh, inspection check or fuck <laughs> insight check. Okay. You see that it seems like he's being honest with you, but it seems like. There's, he's not letting on as much. He's being too cooperative. What's your game, Okar? You know this doesn't end well. Why are you being so cooperative? Well, I prefer not to be dead. And why is that? Does death I... scare you? Yes, actually. I've surrendered, hoping that you bear my life. I know I probably don't deserve it, but then you'd be no better than the white scales. Oh, you, Who you says we're that. better than the white scales? We're actually you guys? fire claws. Oh, I mean, uh, that's we're... to be decided. Yeah. It's, it's I'm just, really, you know... I, I have no clan affinities, so... From what I've seen, yep. you guys are all the same. It's sort of a matter of perspective, really. I mean, they all you you all just fight and bicker and claw for dominance. When if you all just work together, you'd be able to do a lot more than you thought what possible. You, think you're doing? you guys just strolled in here and killed my entire clansmen. We even let you stay here. Hey, I just do what I'm told. Yeah, but one of your guys wouldn't let me, you know, use the mage hand. After you, uh, like, assaulted him in his tent? <laughs> <laughs> Not do we need to wrong. go there? Of how it's fucked no, up that is? No excuse. <laughs> <laughs> He's, like, tilting his head, like, come on, dude. <laughs> Uh, we're okay, gonna go over uh, to Mia Mia as he's uh, exploring the tent there. Um, Mia Mia, what is it you doing as you enter the tent? I just push back the flap like I own the place already, like <laughs> lifting things up, whatever I find, what's in there, inspecting it. All right, you notice that it's uh, it's got like uh, these are decent quarters. There's like a rug that's set out there, like at, at the uh, entrance of the. Uh, the tent there for you to wipe your feet. Oh, uh, you see that uh, there's like um, uh, this being like the armor uh, worker. You see that he's like got like chain mail like set up on uh, certain certain like little dummies or whatever like the, the mannequins or whatever. Um, but yeah, you see uh, yeah, just some armory stuff. Various weapons lying around. I pick up random things, like try on some armor and take it off, flip it around, just poking and prodding. Walking <laughs> around it. There is a mirror. Ooh, I definitely stop, check myself out. Poses. Poses with the chainmail shirt. <laughs> I come out and I'm like, do you guys think this just makes model. me look fat? <laughs> it's not even possible, my lady. Oh, Robert, I keep you around for a reason. So, so drop it. Go back in. Yes. <laughs> Thank you. You'll, you'll, you'll get it, Caddy. Don't worry. 
Uh, is there anything else you'd like to do, Mio Mio? Mostly I'm just like poking around and like looking at the new things that we have. Mm-hmm. Um, and nothing happens when I like go into like the circle that is around that thing, I assume. No. Cool. <laughs> Creepy statue doesn't come to life. Now we gotta fight that. Phase two. <laughs> Phase two. <laughs> Phase two. Oh, I got much, much bigger things planned. <laughs> Let's see, we come out. Oh, All right. Ah. Uh, Jim, what are you up to? Oh, sorry. Go oh, ahead. No, that was it. I just come out after that point. All right, Jib Jib, what you doing? Um, well, after poking the dragon for a little while, Jib Jib will just sort of skip over to Mio Mio, kind of run on all fours real quick. And he's not going to talk. He's just going to look at you with like a pouty, angry face. And then he's going to like mime Godzilla destroying things. Oh, you want the cookie? Jib Jib <laughs> sits down. <laughs> Jibjib was a good boy. I throw him a cookie, which is just a ration. Ow. <laughs> like, I chew it, but it's like kind of dry. <laughs> it oh, so he's making like, up. Yeah, it doesn't look like I'm really enjoying it, but he's enjoying it. <laughs> it's still a cookie. I wanted to destroy the temple, but now I'm happy again. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking about destroying the tower. This statue is ugly. <laughs> it needs, needs to be me. <laughs> to be able to just contently sit down, I'm good. <laughs> All right, but while you two are doing that, do you join uh, Caddy and uh, Robert? Mio, we have a prisoner. Oh my, you really roughed him up, didn't you? Jesus. Okay. What about the smell? Oh no. He's got like pink eye and bruises. <laughs> <laughs> He's lost he a, a couple of teeth. He has a black pink eye. Oh my, Oka, I am. I do apologize for what my companions have done to you. This is horrible. Are <laughs> you? Are you really sorry? Yes, of course. You look detestable. I I enjoyed your face. <laughs> this this I don't enjoy. <laughs> yes, this is. I expected better, but. Yes, so did I. I guess I'm as good as dead if I. Return to the white scales. Why is that? You think they'd let me take me back after that you guys killed all of this clan? Jess, it was a terrible scenario. You really should have joined us when I asked. Yes, I guess I have no right to parlay with you. I was hoping by surrendering you'd at least show some. Oh, you yes, after I threw my blade down. I hold it up as I'm drinking dragon blood. Oh, dear me. Well, here. Sorry, he is, um, how do you say, on loan? We don't really, he just sort of goes nuts every once in a while. We had agreed that the dragons were, you know, not at fault here. Just the clan. Yes, had... why? Hey, I agree, I honestly, I do agree. You said they were yours, I thought they were Meepo's. Well, they... There were the ones that he gave to our regiment. He's a dragon breeder, after all. Yes, I, I see it. And so am I, if you have not heard. I have not heard. Oh, well, it may please you to know that these were not the only dragons. I, of course, have my own. She is a wonderful diamond. Oh. So you have one. Indeed. How many does Nipo have? I count none. You see that he kind of like uh, stares at you there, Mio Mio, and he's like, I'll make you a bargain. In exchange for my life and maybe allowing me to walk out of here, I can give you information. Go ahead. Infam 
information that might prove beneficial if you are to keep this assault up on Meepo. However, I need your word that you'll let me out of here alive. You wish to leave this place alive? Yes. Jib, jib, shake You'll my never see me. I think that is a deal we could make. But first we must see this information. Come, get comfortable. I want to, like, clean off his face a little uh, bit. <laughs> all right. Uh, make a persuasion or deception check. Mio Mio. Whichever I plan to let him leave alive. In what state? That is my state. All right. <laughs> Persuasion? All right. So he's going to uh, sit on the steps there, and he's going to say, All right. What do you want to know? Well, first, how many other dragons does Meepo have? He's probably... Between the clans, he has at least. He start like things, and he's like, probably about thirty wormlings, just mini ones though. He's still got uh, at least uh, half three there, at least with uh, thirty more eggs. He's got maybe two full-grown dragons that are probably within the northern regions of Elmswood right now. And that's about it to my recollection. Awesome. But uh, you probably need to talk to, uh, or at least find out more from the actual hatchery. Like, I'm, I, I, I know, like, that's about it from my knowledge. So. Do you have a map, Okar? Uh, and he, he's like, well, you'll, if you allow it, allow me to uh, get it from my tent, or you can retrieve it. You don't trust me. Jib jib. <laughs> I, just, I run right up to him. Jib jib. We go with the Oka. See, make sure he gets his map. <laughs> he kind of like puts his hands up, and he like goes into the uh, tent there. Jib jib. Uh, you see, like he uh, goes over to his bedside table and opens the uh, drawer there, pulls out like a piece of parchment paper. And he comes out and he shows you a map. He's got a map. Map of. Oh. Take you to the map. Bing. Is it the exact same as ours, or does it have like. Yes, names? it's a, an exact same as ours, but I, it depends on what you guys are looking for. I mostly want to know where the hatchery is and like where all the clans are and like if I could get numbers on who has how many. Oh, trains. the interior. <laughs> the interior. I, I didn't realize you were asking for a uh, map of the actual uh, Frostfang Mountain. I, I do not have one. Darling, I want the map of everything you have. <laughs> not some fool. This is the only map I have. Yeah. We uh, want maps of everything. We want maps of your colon. I, 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 I wish this was a little more specific. I apologize. That is okay. Jib Jib like cracks his knuckles. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you could do us a different favor and label it with the names of each tribe and what you remember of the regiments there. We of course know yours, but who's in the other ones? All right, I can try and uh, get some names there for you, but. As I've already divulged this much, I assume you're willing to still cooperate. You said the information. I want as much as I can, darling. A life is worth a great deal. If you say that, then I guess we can continue. Um, yes, I'll try and remember. I think there's a list of them I, that I'll uh, have to write up there for you. Wonderful. Uh, he's Wonderful. like points at the spots there uh, on the map that are all white scales now, but yeah, uh, he's I like, well, it's a good thing you've come across this one. Um, this is a 
heavily fortified area, as you can no doubt from the entry entryway. And he points uh, uh, at a lever that's on the uh, the far wall there. Um, that seems to be like against a pillar there. Uh, we're still on the big map. Do you want to bring us back? Yep. Yeah, sorry, I'm just slow. Oh, it's okay. Uh, and he is going to uh, point at the uh, the door, or, or uh, point point at the lever, and he's going to point at the door, and he's going to be like, "That's the mechanism to uh, seal off the temple. Nobody will be able to uh, get inside unless they were to force their way through by some larger means or what, like more catastrophic means to blow open the door, but." You should yeah. be safe. Opposed. And is there a back escape? Once we're trapped, is it doomed? Uh, we are not very much aware of this temple, as Meepo was kind of the one to know the secrets of it. I'm I'm just his one of his lieutenants. I see, I see. Well, I believe a deal is a deal. Let's uh, let's get out of here for now. I want to walk with him out. All right. And when I get uh, to Patty, I want to like get ahead of him. Like, all right, in. I want to be like, uh, Cat, do you do you still have your handcuffs? Oh Why yeah, of course. Would you mind putting those on Okar, please? Are these necessary? Why, yes, of course. I said you can leave with your life, not with your freedom. He kind of like bites his lip a little bit and he's like, ah, fine. Can I at least get the key for when I get out? What? <laughs> You're funny, like, oh gosh. Shouldn't we just begin walking? <laughs> no. Careful, Okar. I, I've seen her okay. use those handcuffs for other things. Uh, I'll take your word for it. <laughs> Uh, very well. Best of luck with this place. He's going to walk out in handcuffs. Yeah, mm -hmm. I want essentially to bring him with us to the clan. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you're bringing me to the clan. I thought that's oh, yeah. what she meant too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, like we're taking him. Oh, I thought she was like we, we just putting him in are. the wilds with some chains on. That's so horrific. That's what I thought you were doing. I was. <laughs> oh my lord, no, Oka. Run, Oka. Jim Jim stays stretches. <laughs> he starts running. We just start like shooting at him or something. Oh, like, everybody stop. stop. Yeah, no, okay, you're coming back to the fire clock clan. I thought, sorry, I thought that was obvious. <laughs> no, I, I I, guess it got lost in translation, but no, okay, no. I'm I'm happy about that. I'm yes, we, we will protect you, don't worry, okay. You are useful. Uh, thank you. You're welcome, and I boop him on his nose. I I am a uh, an armorer and a blacksmith, so... If that is any of use to your clan, I I can offer my assistance there, but I'll leave that to your the elders. I don't think it's your hammer she's interested in. <laughs> well, like as elbow I elbow catting. <laughs> yeah, as I am one of the eldresses, I will get you lined up for our trials. How about that? All right, that I guess that's all right. Come on, Jip Jip. Robert, chop chop. Oh, there is no. gold in the back if you want any. Yeah, I wanted to like yes. use the tent as a giant so. sack. <laughs> Get as much <laughs> as I can. <laughs> Drag it out. All right. <laughs> All right. From that gold pile, you are going to get. All right. Actually, you know what? I'm just going to put how much is in there. Remember that time Lua moved at half speed to keep her entire bag of gold? <laughs> <laughs> it's jib-jib. 
sacrifices must be made. You'd be really surprised at how much I can carry. <laughs> One sec. Robert, can you press the digitate? Hey, wait. The thing where you clean something. Chip, chip, can. I know he, uh, he's far away. I, I don't, I don't think so. Oh no! I just want. Okay, that wound seems to be like passing. <laughs> yeah, am I going to be okay? Yes, I think so. Robert just has it. Just usually reacts poorly with people on impact. You get used to him, I swear. I. Uh, I'm Am I at, going to get used to him? And he like, he's not so sure. I'm looking at you, buddy, and I give him like the finger eyes. Can you see me? Look at those cataracts. Holy fuck. The cataract. Oh, the cataract trail. Uh, but Jib Jib, that is what you uh, find in that pile. Sweet. And Jibjo will put the glove on, the ring over top of the glove. We put all the jewels in his mouth and uh, all the coins in the tent sack. All right. Uh, that's going to count to your, your, uh, the 2,000 gold and the 5,000 silver. The rest is like, like little shit. But with the 2,000, 2, 5,000 gold, uh, uh, how much does that up to in uh, weight for you? It in. Um, it's 151 pounds for all the coins, which Jib Jib can carry. Okay. Um, the other stuff, depending on how much it weighs, Jib Jib can carry a couple hundred pounds. So I, I think he's fine. Okay. In which case, yeah, like you basically just run it, or like just have this big sack of fucking gold. <laughs> I would say like he or looks like it's heavy, gold. but he's still pulling it. Like there's like a. A yeah. drag mark on the ground. <laughs> if you can picture it, it's happening. He's the Grinch stole Christmasing it. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You're yeah. a mean one, <laughs> Mr. Jib. Jib, Jib. <laughs> Bring all the Bring all. So does, does right. he carry most of your stuff when you're not using it? Jib, Jib, uh, uh, sometimes. <laughs> That makes more sense now. All right. Um, Robert's gonna like get behind Okar and just like prod him forward with with quick little with your plane, quick little toots. <laughs> ah, stop it! Keep moving, buddy. Ah. All right. <laughs> Five o'clock land. Five o'clock. Ah, oh, don't move too fast there, Caddy. I'm just breakdancing out here. Holy crap! Look at him! Look at those moves! It's incredible. Okay... I just gotta get your token. Ooh. All right. Oh wait, you guys have your tokens on there. So I just need Jib Jib's token and Jib Jib's proper token. But you guys are at the, uh, you guys arrive at the uh, Fireclaw Clan. Uh, you see that um, uh, one of the guards says, "The Aldress is back." And yeah, you guys are uh, welcomed in. That got a present. I wave. Ooh. All right, friends, darlings. Ooh, we have a prisoner. 
still have a prisoner. Everyone, come poke him. <laughs> no, stop poking Oka. You've done enough damage, Robert. Look at his eye. <laughs> I do appreciate that. Now. He's not a prisoner. Yeah, it's still half prisoner. and half. <laughs> I still fired on him. No. No! <laughs> Stop it! <laughs> this is torture. Yeah, dude. <laughs> That's against the Geneva Convention. <laughs> <laughs> Chemical warfare. What the fuck are you talking about? Exactly. Yeah. So you guys enter there. Uh, Ziggy, I don't know if you uh, you make your way there or if you... Actually, you guys can maybe find Ziggy. Yeah, I think it's more of a surprise visit so the guards might call out or something. Yeah, no, they did. Yeah, gosh. Ooh, yeah, maybe you guys, you yeah, see Ziggy out in the distance playing with the dragon baby. <laughs> <laughs> Throwing it up in the air. Cute. That makes me happy. He's like teaching it to fly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's still going to be such a good father. <laughs> we call out when we get close enough. Ziggy! Maybe like waves from a distance. <laughs> what is what is your plan? What's what's your what's your game, Meow Meow? Why are we keeping this guy? Uh well he one has useful information, which I did promise to keep him alive for. Uh two, he would be very useful. We do not have a uh, blacksmith in our clan, and if we're going to war with White Claw. That is useful. You can take a kick in the face too, which is kind that of is... a good thing. Yes. You do least... know it's white yeah. scale, right? Or are you being passive aggressive? What is that? Like? <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> I, don't know, I don't understand. Uh, I mean, like, you know, that, all those, those are all good things. Those scales there, they, uh... What did Have you ever about? noticed how a Fireclaw clan cobalt drives a car like this? Whereas a White Claw cobalt drives a car like this? Exactly. <laughs> uh, you mean like a cart with a unicorn? Glue. Yes. Yes, or oh. glue. No, we, we need information. But uh, I've noticed that the Fireclaw Clan needs a waiter more than than information, really. We have no one to wait tables. Well, maybe that could be his initiation. What are you talking about? I have no one to wait tables. To make weapons and armor. I've, I've like never served food. Stuff. But hey, I, I mean, he can do it. Meaning like bear steak, but I mean like you know I. My proficiencies the forge. The forge of the waiter. Okay. That's okay, not when we kill M when we kill MVP, can we bring back some meat so he can make us some MVP steak? Yeah, that sounds good. Yes. Okay, I think that is the biggest question on joining us. Do you wish to get rid of man bear pig? I I would certainly like to see it stop rampaging throughout the region. And I know Meeple's reasons for doing it, but there's still that threat, so if you guys are dealing with that threat, then I would happily assist. Wonderful. See, settled, Robert. Yeah, we're dealing with that threat. We're gonna take it and, and thread it right through a needle, and then take that needle and thread it through some other stuff and make a sweater. Sweater of security. The entire region. Yeah. All right. What he says. I, I, I agree. All, All right. We'll see them around. What do you do whenever you see them coming? Um, well, I just sort of like hold the dragon. I'll, I'll wait for them to approach me and say what they got to say. 
All right, you guys approach. Ziggy, I return. We um, destroyed all the White Claw Clan in the temple, but I brought back Okar. Yes. Yes. Welcome to the Fire Claw Clan, Okar. You. Tell me, where are oh, your wounds? Oh, Captain Jib Jib eat, eat them. They ate them. Well, Gabby was drinking its blood, to say. That was a little fucked up, not gonna lie. Not gonna lie, it was. It was refreshing. It was a, a, a white dragon wormling. It had some cool, refreshing blood. I apologize. No, no see, Okar, this is something I you thought it might have given of. me magic powers too, but. Um, Stop talking about my dead dragon! If, if you're going to be a waiter, you're going to you might end up serving dragon blood. I oh. do you guys eat dragons? Not usually. You but eat that on thing the and you like points at the the diamond. I snarl and step in the middle. I tried, but yeah. all scales are puffed out like a cat. No, I'm saying, <laughs> are you going to eat that dragon? <laughs> Are you asking me if I'm going to eat it because you want to? No, I, mean, I don't want to. It could be on top of a bit more, though. Are you listening to this, Mio Mio? <laughs> he says he wants to eat diamond. I have just. I don't want to eat diamond. <laughs> it's, it's apparent that whoever wants to eat Why would you want to eat diamonds? You'd break your teeth. Now that baby dragon, though. <laughs> Nobody will be eating the dragon. Why have you come here? Well, I, after your clan's mates have, I guess, bested my, uh, my regiment, I surrendered and they allowed me to live. Yes, he I traded them information yes. for my life. Yeah, allowed is a pretty strong word. Yes, and so far you've shown me a map that I already have. <laughs> But they didn't I've give also us given you. Yes, this is true. I've tried to cooperate as best as I could. Let us be hospitable. He's services as a smith, which is kind of cool. Yes. But what is it that he desires? A life. Oh, that's a good start. Liberty. Liberty. You are currently alive. What more could you want? Tell me. Yeah. Membership. I'm happy to be alive. I'm a little confused. They brought me back, and I guess I'm to be judged by both you and Mio Mio then. He, this guy demands too much. He wants to live and continue living. Yes, yes, yes. that's and all I want. He can eat it too, man. Yes, I thought you could go through our uh, initiation process, same as Robert. Prove his loyalty. Went through an initiation? <laughs> <laughs> it's, okay. it's okay, Robert, it's done already. <laughs> the oh. true Okar, you wish to be Fireclaw clan member. I, I would certainly like to get away from the white scales if possible. They've lost their way, and I've definitely not been approving of their nature as of recent. So I would happily, if you would allow me, Can I, I would uh, be your services to you. And as an exchange of good faith, uh, I, and he looks over at you, Jib Jib, and he's going to say, in that uh, horde pile has... Uh, one of your kobold friends should have a uh, a ring, a fiery ring that uh, might prove beneficial to you, Elder. An exchange of good faith. Uh, can I insight his, he doesn't like the White Claw clan anymore? Uh, yeah, sure. Make an insight check. Uh, 
I should get going. It's like 11 yep. there. Oh, oh shit, yeah, there. I forgot. It is 11. <laughs> All right. Cool. Yeah, I gotta go. Yeah. <laughs> Well, like, yeah, um, yeah. If you guys got to go, uh, we'll wrap it up here. But uh, yeah, Mio, Mio, you you see that he he seems. Yeah, uh, I, kinda, I should get going. You guys have a good night. Have a good night. Yeah, you have a good yeah. one. Later, Bye. guys. Bye, guys. See you, everybody. All right. Take care. You can answer if you'd like. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, yeah. So I'll um, he'll uh, just tell you that. Basically, or uh, sorry. Your insight into him, he 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 seems earnest, but he's like like uh you know, um under with duress. his he's under duress, exactly. And he's like, uh, you know, I he's telling he's telling you guys that basically like, you know, the the white scales, what they're doing is kind of like dictatorial. So he's not really for that. And if that means like maybe proving useful somewhere else if you guys give him the chance he'll he'll take it but he wants to stay alive sweet well good I'll session yeah it was a good session <laughs> all right thanks, thanks for thanks, uh, well, running it sorry i was late no worries anyway take care have a good, have a good, have a good one, one.